Welcome to Primo RV Center and a brand new first look at our 2963BH, one of our most popular family trailers certainly over the last five years and every year they do a little something to improve it. Here we've got up front, we've got our standard power jack with a great little light facing down exactly where you're going to want it, two 20 pound tanks, room for up to three batteries here and we do also have a battery disconnect switch on the front, very handy as it goes in the storage because we do have 100 watts of solar standard on the roof so that'll still charge uh, with that battery switch on on disconnect and we've got easy access to our front spare tire here as we come around the side great pass-through storage but then we also have our proprietary built-in extra front storage area great one for fishing rods keeps them tucked out of the way and especially if they have some great value to you you're going to be able to keep those safe with a full eight foot width there so if it's a seven foot fishing rod quite well We've got uh, lights in the front as well as the very front here. We've got our uh, drill adapter for our jacks. Nice heavy duty front jacks, uh, all four corners. And then we've got our hose up here, uh, which is gonna be for our water spray off station and our 30 amp service co uh, cord here for us. Just past that, we have our awning, which extends all the way past our outside kitchen. So you've got a huge awning here. And this is really the area, obviously, you're gonna live when you get to the campsite. We've got our lip steady steps going in. So much easier to use as we all get older, but also if you've got quite young kids, very stable for them, as well as pets. Pets definitely prefer them because they don't move around. We've got great cross ventilation here with a number of windows on this side, and then we have the additional door, so two screen doors on this side. We've got outside entertainment with a couple of uh, speakers here. We've got a Bluetooth enabled stereo inside so you can stream music to it. We've got all the lighting we need here underneath our awning. And as we come back to the midpoint in the trailer, we've got our wonderful outside kitchen. So a really complete kitchen with a ton of storage so that you can leave a lot of your plates and things like that uh, out there. We've also got our bottle opener for us, a little spice rack in the back, a light. We've got USB power as well as 120 volt power here. We've got storage for utensils. We've got a great sink that will drain into our gray water tank with hot and cold water. And then we've got our two burner stove here as well. And then we can quickly clip into a barbecue as well. We do a propane brought to the kitchen here and you could alternate between the two burner stove and the barbecue should you wish. We've got another power outlet here just past the kitchen. So should you need it, it's already there. And that would allow you to plug in an outside television if you wish or perhaps put one in the kitchen. A uh, small one mounted to the wall if you wish at some point. We've got a cable and satellite output on this side. We've got our black tank flush, which is super handy. So you don't have to put a uh, wand down the toilet to be able to clean your tank and your sensors. You can just use that with a fresh water connection. And then we've got our easy access door on the road or at the campsite to get into the bathroom. So especially with young kids on the road, it could be very handy. Again, especially if you're stuck somewhere and perhaps in a traffic jam that's not going anywhere, you can quickly uh, pop it in the back of camp or use the bathroom without having to open the slide. We've got our great leash holder here for us at the back. Also could be a great spot to lock up bikes. And then speaking of bikes, we've got our secondary storage door on the back here, which is super handy because we're gonna have a 50-50 split in this bed. So basically from where this door starts all the way over, uh, that's all gonna disappear and be able to lock into place straight up so that you can use this as bike storage, large storage for kids' kayaks, all your stackable Rubbermaid bins with all the essentials you bring with you. Or if you've got a bigger family, you can stack up those chairs and tables in the back. So it's really universally super useful. Or if you just wanna use the top of the bed as storage, again, for some of those items, easy access to do that. Easy access to our hot water tank as well through that back door for winterization. Again, another lockable leash holder or in this case a bike storage would be great because you do have a bit of privacy back here with that natural slide. We've got all our hookups back here. So we're on an adapter right now for 15 amp power, but 30 amp service back here. We've got our input for cable and satellite just above and below each other. Our input for water if we've got it on site and this is our spray port that goes with that blue hose we saw just up front so it's a great one to spray off your feet with some cold water uh, bikes if you're got them all muddy so before you maybe put them in the coach or your, your dog's paws certainly spring and fall we've got a great little extra compartment underneath our bunk here so this could be a good one for your power cord water hose those kind of things that you're going to use back here especially at night so everything's close at hand and then easy access to again all the drain ports typically we're on a campsite if you've got services they're going to usually be on that uh, back side so perfect spot aligns very well and then we've got our spain slide here windows all the way around everything is tinted we've got two windows in the bunk as well so you're gonna have great airflow there uh, all these will open on the ends as well so again if you're in an area that gets a bit of natural breeze you're not necessarily going to have to use as much air conditioning here or rely on it or maybe at all which would be great as we come around we do have a little bracket here in the wall 
and uh, within the pouch of the trailer inside is a little uh, automatic level for you so it's going to show you how level you are when you initially get there so you don't have to bring an additional one it already comes with the trailer easily mounts to the side and then just in front of that we have our water fill here so we're pulling into the campground we do want to go to the water fill station easy to get to so just a wonderful coach here for especially longer distance travel with amazing storage both inside and out uh, but some of those additional features like again our outside kitchen that's very complete it's going to keep you guys living outside where you really want to be where we all want to be certainly on those days that are nicer maybe even with a light rain you'd still be out under your awning here and really enjoying that kitchen as well as some of the storage and amenities here you have on the outside we highly recommend coming to see us here at Primo RV Center and taking a up close and personal look at this brand new 2963 Northern Spirit by Coachman.